Hey guys, they will meet one more time. A very warm welcome to all of you and a very good morning. Hope you guys are doing well, right? So in my previous session, I have talked about the office etiquette and about how to be a successful person. So uh, in my today's session, I am going to talk about how you can prove yourself in your office environment and what is the key step you can take to prove yourself. in your office culture because during pandemic we have seen so many uh, candidates who has the skills that were somehow uh, the, uh, for the uh, mental issue for the uh, psychological issue they got sacked from the company or somehow they uh, the company has not find the productivity uh, in their work so if you want to uh, be, be productive how can it be possible and what is the we need to do to uh, make yourself visible in office so i am going to talk about so guys let's just start if you are currently in full time employment the change and uncertainty that has come hand in hand with the covid 19 pandemic may have understandably uh, left you with a feeling that you need to somehow prove yourself as indispensable so this raises the crucial question how can you prove your value in your current business and in your present role in your office okay without burning yourself out in the process so the first one is show how your personality add value that is very much needed okay if you if if uh, you are not going to show it people don't even recognize you okay so product, uh, proactively ask your manager or a member of the senior leadership uh, team how the strategic objectives of the business may be changing how your current role may uh, evolve and importantly how you can personally prepare for the evaluation okay so if they are unsure you uh, could perhaps uh, suggest that you would together to craft your role so that it is an um, as relevant to the post covid era of work as possible okay it is also a good idea to understand how value might be measured in the future by taking a pre empt and creative approach here you will be demonstrating to your employers that you are adaptable and will bring a growth mindset and opportunities that are around the corner as we uh, embark on the next era of work so demonstrate your commitment that is very much needed guys if you are not committed towards your work nobody is going to believe on you okay so demonstrate your personal commitment to learning and establish yourself as an expert one you have an understanding of the current uh, and future direction of your organization ask yourself how you can apply your unique strategies uh, or strengths skills and competencies to help it thrive think about how you can further build on those to establish yourself as the go to expert in a given area in addition develop an understanding of the new skills you may need to acquire in order to play a meaningful uh, part in helping your organization solve problems of on the horizon commit to your learning journey and remember to communicate and uh, document your learning as you go by updating your manager your cv and your linkedin profile protect uh, yourself from distractions okay that is very much needed when you are working in a company because uh, uh, distraction is related to productivity so kindly try to protect yourself from any kind of any distraction perfect your remote working etiquette you are more than likely working virtually right now rather than face to face but that doesn't mean your standards of etiquette should uh, slip it's still possible to practice a uh, perfectly good meeting etiquette uh, via video okay you should also try to perfect your remote work ethic doing everything that you can do uh, to remain uh, productive and track with key tasks uh, and projects note to what 
you would you trigger are that may divert your attention from your work whatever i have said that i'm repeating is one more time so that you can devise a new routine and healthier habits to ensure your engagement and output okay maintain your visibility remotely as we transition to what is likely to be a more hybrid era of work you may find it more difficult to increase your visibility in the workplace you may not be physically in the workplace uh, as often interacting face to face at the same level and building relationship in the same way as you once were it will therefore be especially vital to routinely uh, communicate with your manager and colleagues about uh, the specific project you working on but also about success and milestone achieved uh, including and feedback you have had from your uh, key stakeholders when it came to improving your visibility with your boss don't be afraid a little self promotion you must get comfortable speaking out about uh, your successes and achievements you may also choose to send your manager a weekly summary uh, outlining all the tasks that you have completed and the results generated to date when you do so draw, draw attention to the tangible results as evidence of the impact you have made it may also be a good idea to productively uh, schedule regular catch up uh, meetings if they are not in the diary already okay build and strengthen relationship with key internal influencers identify the people within your organization who have previously been and allied for your career development consider asking them to be your to be your monitor or for their uh, thoughts on how the organization is likely to change in the future and how they re recommend you to go about adapting okay so in return go the extra, extra mile to help them whenever you can uh, crediting them uh, for uh, their work and thanking them that is very important guys right? for their help also don't hesitate to network within your business including uh, introducing yourself to new starters and positioning yourself as the their ally um, from the outset even if only remotely okay so understand how performance will be assessed as many organizations change both uh, where they work and how they work traditional performance metrics and targets may need to be refreshed it's crucial to grasp an understanding of this at, at an early stage you know, so that you can work towards the latest metrics and uh, targets understanding what future performance metrics will be uh, will also allow you to determine what you are doing to be a, a good job and in which areas you may need to make improvement okay guys don't try to be a uh, solo superstar you may be working well as part of a hybrid office arrangement or uh, even completely remotely but you must never forget that ultimately you are a part of a wider team so it's important that you remind yourself of that always have your collective uh, end goal in the back of your mind okay learn to say no proving your value in your current role is not about saying yes to every project that comes your way as your uh, as you progress through your career and you start to get noticed new projects will naturally start coming to you to strategically manage your career through and to build of the success you have achieved so so far it's important that you realize that you simply can't do everything by yourself and you certainly won't be able to please everyone if you are able to consider each task requested and say no in this right way and to the right request 
you will gain respect and further establish your value in the workplace okay stay optimistic while these are challenging times a positive and optimistic attitude will help you to get through in thriving not only is positively contagious within a team it also breeds success so be mindful of how positive and negative uh, the language that you use in and practice compassion with your colleagues including celebrating success and supporting them to succeed don't forget to laugh and try not to gossip about your co-workers it may also help to remind yourself of your organization's purpose and reason for being that's why you can be clear in your head about you uh, your specific role delivers value and gives you a sense of meaning which will reinforce that those positive thoughts okay it's also good practice to set attainable goals for the uh, day so that you feel a sense of accomplishment when you complete them and importantly enjoy a reward when you do be a ambassador for your organization it may seem straightforward enough to collective um, to cultivate a certain culture or personality at your organization when everyone is in same office space but what about when you are not the longer term transition that may organizations are currently making towards hybrid ways of working causes challenges to the time uh, honored nation and um, develop under roof so play your part in overcoming those challenges devote yourself to leaving your organization's value internally and externally and help to build a supportive culture within your immediate team where, uh, whereby you look out for one another as you do share your positive experiences across your business uh, uh, social media challenge channels so that you are actively broadcasting your brand image strike a balance you won't be able to fully and effectively prove your value of the organization but it's not possible for anyone if you are working long hours and failing to prioritize your mental health and well being you will simply feel too exhausted to be able to continue performing at your best so make sure you look after yourself and establish some balance in your life okay so these are the things guys right? whatever i have talked about the uh, how to prove yourself in an organization these things are very important so kindly focus in in these things and if whenever you feel exhausted or you feel uh, that uh, my productivity is being affected uh, for the you know, time period of office time span of office and uh, you need uh, some rest you need to rejuvenate your rejuvenate your mental health time to do it because uh, the leave for two days or one day can help you to think pro proactively one more time okay the rejuvenation rejuvenation is very much much important so do it guys so uh, this is for today's session guys what i want to say that in tcs global there are so many videos technical videos and all those uh, inspirational videos what i am say, sharing with you guys kindly uh, visit our channel see all that videos gain proper knowledge about life about uh, your work etiquette about the uh, how to be a successful person that is very much need to, um, you need to know because uh, that guidance is very much needed and how you can be a proper human being the last but not the least this is very much important how you can be a, a good human being that also you need to know so kindly uh, think about all those things and get that knowledge our trading sessions are going on there are so many uh, technical classes that that videos are going on in our youtube channel kindly go and visit all those videos mm, and uh, if you are interested to get something in your life to be a successful person or if you are a goal oriented person kindly join pcs global we are providing all kind of trainings and each and every training is very valuable guys it can be a free internship it can be paid internship it can be a uh, long term courses so don't waste time because time is everything 
if you are right now you you are sitting in your room and thinking okay i will do it one more uh, day uh, after uh, one month two months three months you are only wasting your time so don't do it guys okay so this is uh, from the unita side kindly subscribe my channel hit the bell icon and comment below so bye for now